Environmental Accounting. One Community Weekly Progress Update, number 511. One Community is a 501c3 nonprofit organization. We are creating open source and free shared blueprints and resources, tools and tutorials, and do-it-yourself instructions for highest good living. Creating solution models that create additional solution creating models in the service of all life on this planet. This includes highest good approaches to food, energy, housing, education, for-profit and non-profit business creation, society, and true earth stewardship. My name is Jay Sable, and I'm the executive director of the One Community 501c3 nonprofit organization. One Community is bringing together people with the consciousness and the desire for the highest good of all life on this planet to build sustainable, regenerative, and self replicating teacher demonstration hubs as a pathway to global sustainability. This is our January 8th, 2023 edition of our weekly progress update, and today's topic is environmental accounting. And I'm wearing my my yin yang nature shirt for this uh for this talk because i think it's appropriate first time i've ever worn this shirt on uh one of our weekly progress updates but environmental accounting like what is that well for us environmental accounting is that we have we have the ability to account for our actions comprehensively like we have the ability to look at our lives and look at the things that we're doing and recognize that Every decision that we make, even choosing not to think about our decisions, is a decision that has an impact on our, our it, it has an effect on our impact on the world. And so environmental accounting, accounting is about looking at our environment, our human environment, our community environment, obviously our physical environment, nature itself, and saying, how can we account for all of our actions and decisions and live life in an ethical and proactive and productive and positive way. How can we live in an environment such that all of our decisions are made to the best of our ability for the highest good of all people and all life on this planet? And uh, one community is the answer to that. One community is created with that intent. One community is created as a place for people that like the idea of working together and holding each other accountable to the idea of what is in the highest good of all people in life on this planet, talking about that, working through that, thinking about that, constantly doing our best to achieving that, achieve that, recognizing that we don't know the answer, but we're working towards the answer constantly and looking to improve and holding each other accountable to that. For people that geek out on that idea and want to create something that can change the world, one community is it. One community is it. And so we're designing one community to address all aspects of life with the mindset of environmental accounting, of environmental accounting, looking at like how can we account for everything that we're doing and how can we make decisions that are positive and proactive in everything that we do, addressing all aspects of, of living. And so we've taken the physical foundations of sustainability and the emotional foundations of sustainability and we put them together as a as a big upgrade, as an improvement, as as a more comprehensive version of sustainability designed to provide a way of living that most people will consider to be far superior in the way they're living right now. And that's because we're addressing all of these different foundations. So the physical foundations of sustainability are what we call highest good approaches to food, energy, housing, fulfilled living, education, economics, and true earth stewardship. And we're putting all these things together in one place to create teacher demonstration communities, villages, cities, and hubs designed to teach other people how to create teacher demonstration communities, villages, cities, and hubs as well. There are solution models designed to create additional solution creating models for the benefit and the highest good of all people on this planet and all life on this planet. And so we're open sourcing and free sharing these solution models as our way of creating a global cooperative, a global collaborative, working together to come up with the best, most sustainable, highest good solutions to continue to evolve these solutions in all the different categories. You know, for food, we want to grow the most, the healthiest, freshest, most diverse food possible without pesticides, 
herbicides or fungicides without spraying poison on it. Imagine that. And that's totally possible to do. You know, and we can grow foods that you can't buy in the grocery store because they don't have a shelf life and they don't do well in that type of environment, but you can pick them and eat them the same day and they're delicious. Sapote is a great example of that that we're already growing, that I'm growing, at least we have it here. So, uh, and there's lots of other fruits and vegetables and things like that as well. You know, in the case of energy, you know, we want to know that our energy is not contributing or is contributing as little as possible to the detriment of our planet. In the case of housing, we want to build housing that is not built with toxins and things that are can that are known carcinogens that cause cancer. We want to live in an environment that's artistic. We want to live in an environment that is healthy. And we want to live in an environment that lasts. We want to build homes that last for hundreds of years, not homes that have to be practically rebuilt every 70, 80 years. And that's possible. That's possible. You know, for fulfilled living and, and an environment of growth, you know, we want to create an environment where people have more things to do than a traditional environment. And even in a, a major metropolitan city like Los Angeles, where I live right now, and all within walking distance, that's completely doable. You know, and so we've done this for all the other areas of our project as well, education, economics, and of course, true earth stewardship and putting it all together in one model, one place to demonstrate what is truly possible. The next evolution of what humanity is capable of, the next evolution of a living environment designed to fully meet the needs of everybody that lives there and to give and from that place of abundance to it designed to give back to others as well, to teach other people how to create this also and to spread this idea around the world until we meet that critic until we meet that critical mass that tipping point such that everybody who wants to participate can and such that we have we are positively and permanently impacting the lives of all people on this planet in some way shape or form and so this is our idea of environmental accounting it's looking at the food, the energy, the housing, the fulfilled living, the education, the economic models, and the stewardship and saying, like, let's create structures for operating and maintaining these and open sourcing and free sharing all of these that simultaneously look at their impacts, think about their impacts, and are constantly looking to give more than we take to improve our environment on the community level, on the local level, on the national level, on the global level, all of these different things and all of these different categories. And let's open source and free share them as individual components that can be replicated and as the complete teacher demonstration hub. And that's what we're doing. That's exactly what we're doing. We're open sourcing and free sharing every aspect of what it is that we're doing, the complete rollout process for all these different things, how to set them up, how to implement them, everything that we've learned along the along the way, you know, everything that we would do differently so that the next version is even better, and creating a living website that will in, evolve indefinitely, doing all this research that we need to do for ourselves and open sourcing and free sharing it for other people as well. It's not really that complex. It's just a hell of a lot of work, you know, and so we're getting it done. And we are an all volunteer organization, including myself doing this. We are a nonprofit organization. We're a non governmental organization. We've had over 600 volunteers contribute to our project so far. And we're doing this because we want to live this way. We're doing this because we want other people to live this way and because we see a sustainable planet within our lifetime, a sustainable civilization within our lifetime. We can change the way we think about living. We can live a life of growth and contribution and connection and making a difference, you know, and variety, you know, meeting the six human needs and so much more than that in a way that is better than the way that almost everybody is living right now. And in so doing, we can make a better world for other people as well. And so this is what one community is up to. And uh, if you like this sort of thing, like and subscribe. Uh, subscribe to our weekly emails. Uh, if you'd like a, a weekly dose of positivity and world change in your inbox, we send out one email a week. Of course, you can like and subscribe to the YouTube channel. Um, if you'd like to see exactly what it is that our all-volunteer team has accomplished in the last week, uh, visit our weekly progress update blog, and you can go back for years and see what we've accomplished. We put out a weekly progress update every single week. Uh, if you'd like to see all of our open source content, of course, visit our website. And if you'd like to help, uh, visit our helping page. Visit our helping page has every, all the different ways. There's ways for anybody to help that wants to. And uh, if you'd like the easiest way to help out, again, like and subscribe or just watch the end. It helps our algorithm. And uh, stick around for another couple minutes and see the bullet points on all the major components of our project. Uh, just a little overview. So... Yeah, with that, 
Happy New Year again. You know, we're a week into it now. 2023 is going to be an amazing year. And until next year, of course, we will keep on keeping on. Thanks for following our progress. The one community approach to highest good housing is eco-artistic home building that is affordable, sustainable, do-it-yourself duplicable, resource and space efficient, and consists of seven different sustainably constructed village models. One Community is also creating an open source duplicable city center. It is designed to be LEED Platinum certified, provide 12 guest rooms, dining for over 150 people, and laundry and recreation space for over 300 people, all while saving money, time, space, and resources. One Community's approach to highest good food is duplicable almost anywhere, scalable for different needs, more biodiverse and nutritious, part of forwarding a global open source botanical garden collaborative and includes nine different free shared and duplicable growing environments. One community's approach to highest good education is designed for all age groups, adaptable to any schooling environment, inspiring and fun for all participants, includes national standards, all subjects, lesson plans, teaching strategies, learning strategies and tools, classroom design, and more. The One Community Approach to Highest Good Society is globally focused, individually enriching, cooperative and collaborative, includes a highest good network and application, four different economic models, and combines fulfilled living and true earth stewardship for the benefit of all people and all life on this planet. <laughs>